In today's video, we are going to have a look at the core generator feature in FL's 2024 update. The image line team has given us a bolt in Scalar 2 like core generator. Now, Scalar 2, in all honesty, is still the best way to go for me, but the potential is definitely here. So if we go inside the piano roll and head to tools, you will find the generator. Upon opening the generator, it will make a random progression and you are free to change the chords as you see fit. Set inversions as you see fit. There's quite a bit of customization in the way you can make the generator think. You also have the added benefit of allowing the generator to stick to more conventional generation, keeping very close to the notes on the scale, or going more adventurous with generation choices. From the preset section, you can also select specific progressions, you can change the rhythm, then you can head to the advanced and performance sections, allowing for deeper customization. Basically setting rules for the core generator, which just to me seem like a more in-depth version of the conventional and adventurous sliders. So let's generate something here quickly. Now, most of the editing menus are open by right clicking. You can choose your scale here and then by right clicking on the chords, you have a whole list of things you can do. To change the scale, it's right click on where the scale shows. Um, as I was saying, by right clicking on the chords, you have a whole list of options. You can add notes, remove the bass note, um, you can transpose, add inversions, add voicings, passing chords, swap chords with others in the, pro in the progression. Sorry. <laughs> The more I dive into this, the more I discover. Oh, hit control and click on each chord and you can edit them all by right clicking instead of individually. And I'm sure as I go, I'll discover more things that you can do with this chord generator. Now, once you've hit accept, those notes will be in your playlist with the scale nice and visible for you to see. I'd love to see this get a little more attention and get even closer to having a bolt in Scalar 2. I mean, this is a really neat feature and it's going to be great to give you ideas and pull you out of your writer's block. Seems like we're getting to the point where you might not need the unison MIDI chord pack to become a millionaire. <laughs> Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, hit like. If you're not already, subscribe to the channel and have an amazing day.